Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to show you guys how to download mods for Oblivion Remastered. Make sure you guys follow along, that way you guys don't make any mistakes, as making one small mistake can make your game crash. With that being said, let's go ahead and jump into it. Alright guys, before we do anything, you're going to need a few things before we even start. You're going to either need WinRAR or 7-Zip. Either one works. With that being said, let's head over to our lovely website, Nexus Mods. You are going to need an account, so go ahead and just make sure you guys sign up. That way you guys have an account. If you don't have an account, you won't be able to download mods. So with that being said, let's go ahead and start downloading our mods. So with Oblivion Remastered, there are a couple different mods. We're going to be downloading a few mods here. We have Better HUD. We have Auto Upgrade Leveled Items. And the reason being is because if we preview the file contents, this one is a .esp file. And the Better HUD is a .pack file. And you need to install these in different locations. There are also some mods that do require uh, Oblivion Remastered Script Extender or OBS C64. Uh, I'm also going to show you guys how to download this as well. Uh, if we go to actually requirements down here, it's going to show you which mods as of right now need this. Let's say you want the oh, no carry weight or you want like the less NPC greetings, things like that. Um, regardless, I'm going to show you guys how to download this. So first things first, we are going to locate our game directory. You're going to right click Oblivion Remaster on Steam. You're going to go to manage and browse local files. That takes you directly into the game directory. You don't have anything to worry about. This is where we're going to need to go. Uh, once we download our mods so put that to the side and we'll come back to it and to locate your game on the game pass version of oblivion remaster you're just going to open the xbox app you're going to right click it you're going to go to manage files and browse in this folder though you're going to have your game save and you're also going to have your oblivion remaster folder. you're going to click another here and you're going to go into content and this is pretty much where you're going to end up being if we bring our steam version over they're just about the same. You're gonna have a little bit of different stuff. But if we go ahead and click into Oblivion Remastered, you're gonna see Binaries Content Plugins. Same thing on this side, Binaries Content Plugins. So we are in the same folder pretty much. With that being said, let's go ahead and drag our Xbox Games folders to this side. All right guys, let's go ahead and download Oblivion Remastered Script Extender because this is gonna be the required mod for some mods, which you may wanna download. Um, and you're gonna need to down download this one first in order to download the mods and for them to actually work. So let's go ahead and hit Files. Let's hit manual download. Make sure you guys hit manual download as there's no mod loaders at the moment. This could change in the future. If it does, then the whole process will probably change. But I always personally do like doing manual downloads anyways, because that way I know what I'm doing. If something goes wrong, I can go in and fix it. So with OBSC downloading, let's head over and install it. All right. So what you guys are going to do is you're going to go back over to your Oblivion Remastered folder or the Steam version. You click on Oblivion Remastered. You're going to go into binaries, you're going to go into Win64, and this is where we need to be. So now we're going to pull up our downloads folder. You're going to extract this. Like I said, we are going to need something to extract it. I have WinRAR, so that's what I'm going to use. I'm going to go ahead and delete the other folder. Open that up, and you're going to drag and drop everything except for the SRC folder right here. Do not drag and drop the very last one here. It might be at the top for you or in another spot. For me, it's at the bottom. Do not, once again, do not drag this over. Just everything but the SRC. You're going to drag and drop into Win64. Boom. All right, guys. So after you guys dragged and dropped the OBS C64 into your Win64 folder, what you are going to do, this part you have to do yourself because it could be located uh, somewhere else for you in terms of your file directory. Make sure you guys click up top. You're going to copy this here. Then you're going to go to your Steam. You're going to go to Oblivion Remastered. You're going to go to Properties. I'm going to delete this all because we're going to do this together. You're going to do the open quotations, right? You're going to hit Control V. Boom, that's going to give you the location uh, path. After you went ahead and pasted it, you're going to go backslash, and you're going to type in obse64 underscore loader dot exe, and you're going to close quotation, and then you're going to hit space, and then you're going to hit dash dash space percent command, oops, command, percent so it should be backslash obse 64 underscore loader dot exe close quotations space dash dash space percent command percent and i am going to go ahead and copy this for you guys so you guys can just copy and paste it into your uh properties here that way it makes it a little easier for you guys so we're going to go ahead and exit out of this and hit play and you're going to see a cmd pop up like you did and oblivion is going to start to run and obse will work there we go and our game is running and now our game is ready to install the mods required that require obse with that being said let's go download these other mods and show you guys how to do it
All right, so first things first, we are going to download the auto upgrade leveled mods. If we go to the files and go to preview files, it is an ESP mod, so it, it will be different than the other one that we are downloading. I'm going to show you guys how to download this. Remember, make sure you guys manual download. At least for now, there's no mod loaders at work at the moment. Slow download. Boom. Now, if we go over to our lovely, lovely downloads folder and extract, cabal, and we open up the extracted folder, go into auto upgrade level items, data, and we're looking for this ESP file. This is what we need to drag and drop. So if you guys go into your Oblivion Remastered folder, remember, this is the main directory folder. Go into Oblivion Remastered. You go to Content, Dev, OBV Data. You go to Data. And then you're going to drag and drop the ESP folder into here. Boom. This We're not done yet because right above where it dragged, you see a plugins.txt folder. If this is not there for you, it might be up here somewhere. But... Open up your plugins.txt folder. And if you guys don't see these .txt, ESM, ESP folders, you guys need to go to the little three dots here. Go to options. Go to view. And then look for the hit hide extensions for known file types. You want to make sure that it's unchecked, right? You do not want this checked. And then you hit apply. And we should be good to go. Okay, so now that we opened up our plugins.txt, we're going to go ahead and click on the auto upgrade rewards.esp. You're going to hit F2. And you're just going to grab this whole whole thing. You're going to grab the auto upgrade rewards.esp. You need to make sure that it has the entire thing. Right? Then you're going to hit control C, go here, hit enter, and then control V, and just file save. And now that mod is installed and you are good to go. The next mod we are going to be downloading will be the better HUD. This one depends on your monitor. I have a 69. I'm going to go with the slim version as well. You guys can kind of see, I think if you go through here, this one shows the default, what it looks like. You guys can go through the photos here and determine which one you guys want. Um, but I'm going to go with the better slim, HUD slim. I'm going to manual download because I do have a 69. All right. So now we're going to right click. We're going to extract. Kabao. We're going to delete that folder because I no longer need it. All right, so after we extracted the better HUD, we're going to go into it all the way until we see the dot .pack uh, files. Now we're going to go into our Oblivion Remastered directory. And then we're going to go into Oblivion Remastered, Content Packs. You're going to right-click and hit New Folder. And you're going to do the tilde key, or squiggly line as I like to call it. And then just type in Mods. Enter. Once you do that, you're going to drag and drop these pack files in to your mods folder you can't really see it but it does say move to mods on my screen bang and if you open up your mods folder you are going to have your mods so now let's go ahead and load up oblivion remastered and make sure that we have the better hud working all right as we guys can see as we are in if i just punch oh we got a crab hold on hold on let me let him hit me you see our our health and our stamina is in the bottom left corner our compass is up top. It is smaller, I believe, than normal. And we are moving and grooving. And ladies and gentlemen, that is how you download mods for Oblivion Remastered. If I was able to help you guys out, make sure you hit the like button down below. And let me know down in the comments. If you guys would like to learn how to download Reshade, it is linked in the description. And it will be linked in the pinned comment down below. Um, with that being said, I will see you guys in the next video. You guys have a good one. Stay safe. Take it easy. Peace.